Hey everyone, welcome to another pour video. Uh, in today's video, I'm playing around with camera pigments again, and it kind of turned into a negative space painting, even though I didn't really have an, uh, any intention of it being negative space, but uh, I guess that's just kind of what it turned into. Um, as I was painting it, I thought that it was uh, fighting me every step of the way, but I think that my brain was just fighting me rather than the painting. Uh, as I was reviewing the footage of the video, I was actually really upset that um, I lost the look of the first part of this video. I think that it, right here is super dramatic looking and pretty cool. But for some reason I had it in my head that I wasn't liking it. So I threw a ribbon on and the ribbon initially uh, looked really cool. But then I had to spin it because uh, that's actually quite a lot of paint on there. And if I didn't spin it, uh, it would likely crack because the paint would have been so thick. Uh, so. A lot of that paint came off and turned my little plastic play pen into a skating rink. And I kind of wish that I uh, had like my little metal cleats that I just purchased to walk around Montreal in. Uh, anyways, I digress. So I lost a really cool look of the first part of the painting. And uh, at this point I was actually pretty sure that it was going to turn into a disaster painting again. But I decided that I was going to just keep on, uh, keep it on, and see what happened. I think I ended up doing like three or four ribbons on this. Uh, there was a lot of ribbons that were happening anyways. Um, I brought out my little snowplow thing. I hadn't used it in a while, so I thought that maybe I'd just, you know, give it a little test run again. Um, and the white splatter there actually um, spread out way more than I anticipated. But, uh, you know, I was just working with it. I really like that ribbon that I put on there. Um, I wish that the little squiggles had um, maintained its, their integrity uh, when I spun, but I kind of lost it. Um... And then I had a big problem with this white. I mean, I scraped it all off, but I had put white over top of color. And then when I tried to smooth it out, obviously the color came up through the white. So I had, there's a whole section of this video that I cut out because I had to make more white paint again. Um, and I started planning another ribbon. Um, I thought that the painting really needed like a little vocal point. And I think that this really accomplished um, that need. I, th I think that it ended up really uh, cool looking. There's a lot of little interesting features going on there. I'm just cleaning up my white paint again there. And I'm actually relatively happy with this painting. I mean, it looks a lot different than my other ones, but uh, that just kind of seems to be the trend with this uh, painting. I, I mean, I can't, I can't make any of them look the same. Anyways, that's about it. I hope you liked watching my video. If you did, remember to hit like and make sure that you've subscribed to my channel. And check out my website, uh, m4r2d.com. Thanks for watching. I hope that you have a great day. Bye.